Hi. The uh, PHMSA document from July, uh, with the notice of proposal we're making, certainly has got everyone's attention. Here at MEA, what we did is we reviewed that document and provided comments and, and some of our thoughts on, on what were some of the more serious points, and we sent that out to, your, to all of our members. Hopefully, you received a copy of that. What we see as some of the more significant changes, one is the covered task definition, which goes from the four-part test, and now it's more safety or integrity of the pipeline. There's also program effectiveness, and what does that mean that on an annual basis you have to review your program? There's changes along training, and there's additions to the knowledge, skills, and ability, with ability now being emphasized more than in the past. Much of the language that is in the document is from ASME B31Q, so the question you have to ask, are they going to be incorporating by reference at some point? And if they do, what does that mean to your program? And here at MEA, we're asking ourselves, what does that mean to the products and services that we provide to support your programs? Beyond uh, providing the initial comments, we also made the offer that you could provide your comments to us, and MEA is going to be providing those comments to PHMSA as an association. And so I know some of you are doing those on your own at your company level, but if you'd like to submit those to us, that would be great, and we'll add them to the collection that we're starting to receive. Uh, the way we're going to end that process is on September 3rd, we've charged our technical training and OQ committee with looking at all of those changes and find, creating a final document. Patrick Van Beek, our president, will be part of that process, and so the idea would be to complete the document by September 3rd and submit it to PHMSA for their comments and review. Of course, uh, we'll keep watching this process because it's, it's significant, and so once all the comments are submitted, we'll see where FEMSA goes with those, and we will be reporting back to you. Thank you.